what an absolute beautiful morning. I love this light, it's beautiful light. I'm feeling festive. How are you doing guys? I hope you are too. Um, just a very quick side dish, a quick one. Um, just with vegetables, festive. That's what I'm thinking. So this is what I'm gonna be using, um, a butternut squash. Um, pears, great combo with this. Red onion, rosemary, mm, honey, and white balsamic. Roasted butternut squash, red onion for a little bit of sweetness, and I'm using some pears. Great combo, uh, Bartlett pears, great for baking. If you can't find Bartlett pears, I mean, these are pretty common, you can really get these. Uh, but if you can't find these, try and get some Concord pears. They're really, really good as well. Uh, but these are strong, strong as an ox, and they, you know, they hold up. So first what we need to do is uh, make a reduction. I've got some white balsamic. Um, if you can't find white balsamic, just use normal balsamic. And we're gonna do a reduction. We're gonna reduce it and reduce it. And what that means is the flavor is gonna intensify, it's gonna get more sweeter, it's gonna get more flavorful, and it's a great finisher. So when you pan, add your balsamic. And add a sprig of rosemary. That'll create some nice flavor. Right, you want to bring this up to a boil and you want to reduce it until it's nice and thick, until it uh, coats the back of a spoon. You, you can smell the rosemary just getting stronger and uh, the, the vinegar just intensifying. It's beautiful. The, the kitchen smells great. So while that's reducing, uh, we're going to prep the veg. So first, top and tail, your squash. Chop your squash in half. Get a really nice sharp knife for this and then just peel. Cut in half and you'll see some seeds, these things. And then just grab a spoon and scrape them out. And you can um, toast these, great toasted. Uh, a little bit of salt, a uh, little various spices on them. Great in salads. Like I said, great on their own. Really nice. But I'm not gonna use these today, but save them. And I want these to be fairly thick, like little boats. Then add to a bowl. Beautiful. So slice your pear in half. Take out this little stem, like that. Slice in half again. And then just take out this core. And same with the onions. I just want to cut them into chunks. Add everything to a bowl. Your onions, your pears, everything. So to finish off, I'm gonna add a little bit of um, rosemary just over the top. That'll give it some beautiful flavor. Little bit of salt and pepper. Some olive oil. Beautiful, get all that on. Right now, just get in there with your hands. Get all that rosemary on, that salt and pepper, the olive oil, get it all nicely coated. And we'll roast it. Now get all that on your tray. It's smelling amazing. And they're not even cooked yet. Give it a little shake. All right, my veg are in. I've got a lot of veg cooking. I've got some veg cooking in the oven. I've got some veg cooking in the toaster oven. So I'm cooking a lot of veg. My reduction's done and it's nice and thick. Come and have a look at this. Look at that. It's reduced down. It smells amazing. Got a nice rosemary taste, vinegary, sweet. That's what you want, a great finisher. You only just want like a little drizzle over there because it can be too much. So be careful, but it's, it's well worth it. So we're gonna put that to one side. I've got my pan and uh, I'm gonna toast some almonds. Uh, if you can't find almonds, walnuts are good. I've uh, done this with walnuts and it's just as good, but uh, almonds, I prefer almonds. They're buttery, they're neutral, got a nice texture and beautiful. Man. So they're nice and toasted, so. We're gonna crush them in a pestle of mortar. And then just lightly crush them. Don't go too crazy. You want these to have texture. You don't want them to be like um, brick crumbs. Right, these should be nearly done. 
In the last 10 minutes of cooking, I'm just going to add some honey just over the top. Man, these beautiful festive colours. It smells amazing. Just give that a little shake. And put it back in the oven for about 10 minutes and that's it. Oh yes, yes, yes. Mm. Right now to finish off that rosemary balsamic reduction. Now this is to your own taste buds. So go easy, easy tiger. Just like a little bit. Put some on, taste it. Ooh, it's beautiful. Festive heaven. And to finish off some beautiful toasted almonds just over the top. It's a simple side, but the flavor's up there. So I'm gonna, I'm gonna try one of these pears. Mm. It's a great combo, it really is. And those pears work really well with the onion and the, and the squash. Uh, that rosemary balsamic just, just lifts it. It really does. Um, it's, it's amazing. It's a simple side. Like, like I said, it's a simple side. Flavors there. Easy to do. Give it a go this Christmas or anytime. Great with some nice pork tenderloin, uh, some honey ham. Great on its own. Anything. Give it a go. Thanks, guys. <laughs>